Hey guys, Shane here, CryptoFish YouTube channel. Uh, so today we got some Tron TRX token mig migration news. And also we're going to go and see what my rigs did over the weekend. All right, be back in a bit. All right, guys, real quick before we go on, um, I got something going on called Bitcoin Fridays um, where I give away Bitcoin every Friday. So what you want to do real quick, be sure to subscribe, hit that bell icon below so you'll be notified when the uh, video comes out to enter to win. All right. So with that, let's jump into the news. All right. So let's navigate over here. Cryptocurrency news. Uh, Tron TRX token swap nears. Yet Tron is down 37% since the mainnet launch, which I know all too well. Uh, the Tron mainnet was released just nearly three weeks ago, but TRX's price is yet to reflect the monumental event. It remains unknown if investors are just waiting to see if the mainnet had any crucial bugs or flaws before cashing in, but two and a half weeks later, the coin is still dropping. Tron's vision is years from completion, but it is surprising that investors hadn't gained any confidence from the fact that Tron, the Tron team, finally released the Tron blockchain. TRX token swap. TRX's token migration is set to start this Thursday and will continue on through the 25th. So there's only a couple days left here to get your you know, Tron tokens on an exchange if you don't want to have to fool with swapping them yourself. Um, you see a little tweet from Justin Sun. Already more than 25 exchanges are supporting TRX migration on June 24th. All the information is here. Uh, I'll show you that page here in a sec. Um, at this time, all exchanges that have TRX on their platform will perform the migration for its investors. From June 21st to the 25th, TRX withdrawals on these exchanges will be suspended. And on the 25th, both withdrawals and deposits will be suspended. TRX holders must transfer their TRX to the exchange they traded their TRX for before June 21st. In other words, just get your Tron tokens on an exchange. One of, the, one of these ones I'll show you right here real quick. And you can pause the video. But it's right here. So let me shrink me a little bit. These are all the exchanges that are on board right now, so you don't have to do anything but put your, you know, coins on there. You know, you got Binance, some big ones here. Uh, they just linked up with Huobi. You got Bitfinex. You got tons of exchanges, Bitrix. So the easiest thing to do is just get them out of your wallet here before today's the 18th, I guess, what, before Wednesday. And just get them on an exchange, leave it there for a couple days, and then put it back on your wallet. And you won't have to worry about manually trying to um, do it, which they will do for you, but it's just easier this way, I think. At least that's what I'm doing. All right. So back over here, Tron price movement. Well, there hasn't been really any movement except for down. Um, Tron's digital token saw a spike in price around the middle of May, but has since dropped and continues to drop. At press time, TRX is trading at 0.042 a coin. It's actually a little bit higher than that today, I'll show you in a sec, uh, which is down 2.07% in the last 24 hours. For the week, Tron is down almost 10%, and for the month, Tron is down almost 38%. It remains unknown if Tron or TRX will rebound after the token migration is completed, but many senior analysts predicted TRX would spike just after the mainnet launch and were flat wrong. So here we are here. So let's check out TRX. I just looked at it a little bit ago. It was up. Everything is up today just a little bit. So Tron is up 5%. Um, nothing big. 0 0.045. Um, like, you know, I guess it's better than going down. It's a nice little spike, I guess, at the end right there. Can't even see it on this... Um, chart but anyways but here is the uh, this is tron.network this is goes over the migration I'll put a link to for this down in the uh, description below um, it says right here 
For exchanges from ERC-20 token to mainnet TRX and TRX offering, please refer to relevant files. That just sends you over to a link. Uh, if your Tron is held in a wallet and you are not aware of the migration notice or saw the migration notice after June 25th, please visit our permanent token exchange counter to exchange your token for Tron for the mainnet TRX, the new uh, coin. So you'll still be able to swap it, but I would just get it on an exchange so you don't even have to deal with it. It, it would be easier that way. All right, so on to what the rigs did over the weekend. Um, 533 electronium mines so far this week. Um, sitting at 1528 of Ethereum that was converted to Bitcoin. <clears throat> this rig right here was down today. I just noticed I just got it back up. It's down for like six hours. So here it is now. Um, you can see, you might be able to see that. Rig up time, 21 minutes. So I only got it up just a little bit ago. Uh, but I don't know why. I had a power surge the other day. Two days ago is when it went down as well. So I hope that didn't do something to that board to where it's acting up. But we'll see. Um, I just did knock the overclocks down on this a little bit. I'll show you that. Uh, I left the 580 alone and the 570 alone. But all the 560s are now at 1150 core and 2050 memory with a 6 power stage. Target, te target temperature at 65. Minimum fan speed 55. So I'll keep an eye on it. I lost about a mega hash and a half. Nothing too big. If it makes it stable, then I'm not really going to worry about it. So probably we'll have nothing here on uh, Mining Pool Hub. It's, oh, there it is. It's already picked up some electronium. So at least it's back online and it's working. Luckily, my uh, boys are home. I called them up and walked them through how to reboot and uh, get the rig set up. So that's working um, working good. Uh, total volume mine so far to date, $407.31. So we're up about $15 from last week, which is good. It's better than being down. We were down last week, down 7% last week. So at least it's going in the uh, right direction. But we're only at $22.39. I don't think we're going to get anywhere near last week's. $48 because the rig was down. It's been down twice so far this week. First time, luckily, I caught it um, pretty quick. So, you know, usually I can walk in the door and my little office is sitting right there and I can hear that one rig going. And if I can notice that those fans aren't spinning like they should, then I know it's down. Or I can just log in remotely like I did today and see that it's down. But, anyways. I'm guessing we'll still hit 40 something dollars, but it'll be another another down week. Um, I'm not too crazy confident about the market with its little up spike. Uh, I guess we'll have to wait and see. So Bitcoin's at up 3% today, 288 billion. Bitcoin dominance, 40%. First time I've seen it in the 40s in a while. So. This is just my opinion, but I don't think the markets, I think they're going to be sitting there either going sideways or even drop a little more over the next couple of months. But again, don't take my word for it. That's just my, my guess. Uh, I don't see it going up anytime soon. I think we're just going to be staying in this little pattern, maybe even drop a little more. And hopefully by the end of the year, when some of these regulations are done and in, uh, and some of these institutional investors will start getting on board, then we'll see it go back up. But don't really know why it spiked up here. Um, maybe I'll look into it later. But as it goes up and down, I'm kind of numb to it now, so I don't really, it doesn't really get me excited when I hit 3%. Now, if it's a week of sustained 2 to 3% gains, then yeah, that'll be pretty exciting, as I think everyone would agree. But other than that, I'm not going to uh, care too much. So, so with that, I guess that's it for today, guys. Like I said, I'll leave a uh, link to the Tron website here down in the description. 
and just make sure you guys get on one of these exchanges down below right here um, you can pause the video and take a look or you can just head over to that site just get them on the exchange and then you can probably more than likely uh, pull them back off on the 26 I would imagine 27th at the latest um, just to make it easier on yourself alright guys you guys got any questions or comments just put it below the video remember, uh, remember be sure to subscribe hit that bell icon um, and with that you guys uh, guys again have any questions let me know below I like reading them and I definitely get back to them guys alright so with that you all have yourself a good day happy mining and I will see you in the next one bye